watching the SCAC Player of the Week interviews. It's week seven of the SCAC men's soccer season, and today we're joined by the SCAC men's soccer defensive player of the week, sophomore defender Tom Whitwell of the Trinity University Tigers. And Tom, congratulations, and thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you very much. Tom, you and the rest of your Tiger teammates now know 7-3-2 on the season, a perfect 5-0 in SCAC play, having won six straight and in good form as we head into another weekend of SCAC play. Speak to the group's confidence right now. You know, how has this team been able to, to find uh, its stride here despite maybe a tough start to the season, but now certainly playing some of its best soccer? Where have you found confidence as a team? Yeah, I mean, the last few weeks has been... Um... We've, we've been going into games with a lot of confidence. Uh, practice has been good. We've been training well. The whole team's pretty confident. Obviously, the first few games of, um, of the season, we, we struggled a bit and got some poor results. But um, definitely more and more each week, we, we're gaining confidence <clears throat> and know that we can we can perform on the game day, um, which is which is sort of what we're aiming for every game. Um, so, yeah, it's just been been confidence uh training's been good and yeah everyone's been happy really tom defensively this team has been outstanding during this six game win streak allowing just four goals in that time frame including posting three shutouts what's been key for this group in terms of limiting limiting opponents in that offensive third and making it difficult for for other teams to find the back of the net uh, i mean we've got we've got a strong set of personnel um, we've got, it's not really just a back four. We've got a lot of players that can get involved, um, whether it's left back, right back or centre half, that can sort of play, come in. Um, so we change it up a lot in games, really. Um, we have a starting group and then we have a lot that, that switch in um, with tired legs and stuff. So I guess that's that's definitely one part of it. Um, we've got a lot of, we've got a few very good senior players that that lead from the back as well. Um, that are useful having there because um, they just give, give the team a lift really and if you have, you've got a strong defender that's going to put their body in the line then, then that's what you want in a team team player really. Tom, uh, originally a native of England, you come to America and find your way to San Antonio for your collegiate career now in your second season there at Trinity. How did you get you know, to Trinity? T talk to me a little bit about your your journey and your transition here and, and how much did, did being a part of this program last year help maybe ease some nerves and make things a little bit easier here in your second season there at Trinity? Um, yeah, I mean, I came over um, from basically the Midlands in England. I use an agency um, called Ethos who were really helpful in speaking to coaches. Um, and yeah, various coaches from the States. Um, and then they they sort of linked me up with with Coach McGinley, um, who I sort of hit off with from the start. He he was originally from England, which helped, I think, because um, he sort of knew he knew the English system um and he knew how how things worked. Um and then yeah, sort of from there, just just thought I'd give it a shot. Um, something a bit different. Um and yeah, it's paid off really. I really enjoyed my first year. Um, and going into the second year, obviously, is a bit easier. You've got less nerves, um, but sort of just more hungry for it, really. Um, just ready to ready to get going, get training, um, and just sort of put everything into it because we wouldn't really get this opportunity back at home um, going into a UK university. So, yeah, just, just really relishing every moment, really. And finally, Tom, you and the rest of your teammates on the road for two huge SCAC fixtures this weekend, taking on St. Thomas on Friday and then Centenary on Sunday. What are your expectations going into the weekend and what will be key for this group to continue to build on this 5-0 and start? Yeah, I mean, obviously we're on the road again. Um, seem to be, seem to be, it was a lot this, this, this season. Um, but we're just trying to take every opportunity we can. Um, we've got St. Thomas uh, Friday. Um, we're heading over there tonight. Um, and yeah, just I think everyone's excited to because we know we know how big of a game it is. St Thomas are always a very good, strong team. Um, but we know if we can if we can put them away, then it puts us in a good position for the end of the season. Um, and same for Sunday as well. We just got to take every game as it comes, really. Um, but yeah, we we've got we're full of confidence. We've got everyone in the squad really ready, raring to go. Um, and yeah, just more excitement than anything really um, to sort of put these two teams away. A native of Warwick, England, and this week's SCAC Men's Soccer Defensive Player of the Week, sophomore defender Tom Whitwell of the Trinity University Tigers. Tom, again, congratulations on your honor, and best of luck as you continue to march forward your sophomore season. Thank you very much, Russell.